Now, do you remember on Tuesday I told you all about my new puppy, Angus, and like all puppies, he's been a little bit of a handful. Today, though, help is at hand. I'm joined by celebrity dog trainer, Steve Mann. Steve, it's lovely to see you. Lovely to see you too. And I know that you have helped many a person with their wee puppy. Yeah. <laughs> with their little puppies and how they get on. Hopefully. Main thing is, um, I guess, when they're wee, that's just like toddlers, you know, you have to do the whole sort of potty training thing. <laughs> potty training <laughs> when they're wee. Yeah, no pun. Yeah, yeah absolutely. It's a, it's a real bugbear. Um, and it's the main thing because no one wants those kind of presents anymore on their no. carpet, you know. <laughs> so the most important thing is to heavily reinforce the behaviour that we do want. Right. So when puppy goes out in the garden, yeah. bring puppy out at the most opportune time. So after feeding, after waking up, after a play, after a visit, after any kind of excitement, go out in the garden, hang out, and when puppy goes to the toilet on the grass, then go bananas, so go crazy. It's, like, la, 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 la. it's the best thing okay, in the world. Banners. You're weird, mate. But it's, yeah, <laughs> let the neighbours there at it again, dancing around dog poo. But if you heavily reinforce that, you know, Angus is going to want to do the behaviours that pay to good dividends. So, sure. yeah, reinforce what you do want. At the moment, he's chewing a lot, obviously. Uh -huh. He's chewing me, he's chewing everything that's going. How do you stop them? Yeah. Should you stop them? What so you those, do? yeah, do stop them, because <laughs> it really hurts. Yeah, you know that. So... The reason they have to chew is because they need to explore. Toddlers have to touch everything. Right. So puppies just got their mouth to explore. But also, Angus is teething, and there's just, oh. ultimately there's going to be 42 teeth. You rub them through those gums, so there's yeah. a bit of pain killing mm. needs to be done as well. Offer appropriate chew, chew toys, something like... Yeah, he's got, oh, he's got lots of toys. So this here is Ooh. a Kong. This is a very special toy. Right. If you fill this with food, so he can chew down on that, so that's nice, ah, constructive that's really chewing. Yeah. And over night time, it helps him relax and chill out as well. So you'll kill right. loads of birds with one stone. So use a Kong, fill it with good food, keeps him busy for half hour. You can patch up all your bite marks. <laughs> Everyone's a winner. That's a great idea, it really is. He's not doing it yet, but he probably will, about jumping up on people, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a difficult one, isn't it? Yeah, so jumping up, I mean, that's a natural behaviour. Yeah. Puppies, will, puppies will jump up at their mum to, to lick her lips, she regurgitates food, right. and then they eat. I'm not, not going to do nice. that. Don't no. do that, no. <laughs> no, I wouldn't recommend it. So, again, reinforce what you do want. So when four feet are on the floor, yeah. that's the fuss. That's when you say hello. Don't, don't give a big fuss. Don't reinforce jumping up. Right. Because they're so cute. People often do, and then I they know. get big and dirty and mucky, and then we decide we don't want jumping up, Beep. and that's not fair. So reinforce four feet on the floor, or... A sit, if you can have a perfect sit, that's right. going to get you out of a lot so of trouble. You're going to show me how to do that later, aren't you? We're going to, we're going to go puppy school, we are. We absolutely are. Now, I wonder, though, I wonder what you think about this. Uh -huh. It's trending this morning. It's called a dog onesie. Whoa! I'm not sure about this. Apparently, it makes dogs feel less stressed, but I can't imagine it would because we'd all be laughing at them. Man, it's making me feel a little stressed. What do you think? It's a bit so... strange. How much? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh. So there is a place for a certain kind of product, which is when dogs are feeling anxious or have a specific fear. Yeah. Um, where that that contact, it, it's similar to what I use with autistic children. So just oh, so right. they've got that 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 contact helps them sure. feel a little bit more secure. So they've got a place there, mm. but not to not stop sand or to stop the no. dog's coat shedding. If you don't yeah. want to, you don't want dog hair in your house. Guess what? You shouldn't have in your house. Is that with your dog? <laughs> oh. Yeah. So, Gorgeous boy. Well, you're going to go to puppy school later on. Yeah, and we'll see how good you are. But you've been fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. You're perfect. Gorgeous. Can only go wrong. Now, now, do you know what? If you've got a new puppy, we would love to hear from you. Do send us your pictures. And if you've got a question for Steve as well, let us know about that because he is the expert and knows everything. Thank you. We'll see you later. See you later. Bye bye. Now,